How did I make this? This. And this. Well, if you are interested, watch this full video. But before that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos and updates. Here we have a waiting shed that is round in shape. To view this model in a circular motion or in a turnaround movement, we should make the camera follow a path. And here's what we have to do. Select all control plus a and let us make this model to be all in one group. After selecting all, right click and select make group in the options. Now let us create a model name layer in the layer tray on your right. Then, select the object and assign it to the newly created layer. Next, locate the center of the model. And extend the line up to the floor line level. Now select the polygon tool to serve as our camera path. Now the value of the side is 6 side, we can increase the sides by typing 8 to make our scene transition smoother. And you will notice that the polygon cursor becomes 8 sides. Now point the cursor at the center of the model. Click for the first time to serve as our polygon center. And move the mouse outside of the model and enter the radius value of 25 meters. Scroll down to see the overview of the polygon. And now we have this 8-sided polygon. Delete the polygon surface by selecting and pressing delete key on your keyboard. Now the polygon perimeter sides is location at floor line level. Let us move this upward by using the move tool. Click and type 10 meters. Since now the polygon side is elevated, and we can still see the center line of the model. Now use the position camera tool and first click and hold at one of the corner points of the polygon sides. Then drag the cursor to the bottom point of the center line. And you notice that the camera now is positioned at one corner of the polygon facing the center of the model. Now, go to the view menu, then animation and select add scene to create your first scene. Next, click the position camera tool again. Click hold and drag the cursor from the second corner of the polygon to the bottom point of the center line again. Now our camera is facing from the second corner to the center of the model. Now, click on the Scene 1 tab and select Add option to add your second scene as Scene 2. For the third corner, let us hide our model first to see the center line of the model. Click I button in the layer tray to hide the model temporarily. And do the same thing using the Position Camera tool. Display the model after positioning the camera, and then right-click on the scene 2 to add another scene. Repeat the process and complete them all.
Now let us see the exported .mp4 video file.